Hey YouTube, it's Alicia here, and I want to come and I want to talk about five WWE super, five WWE superstars because, as y'all know, this is Monday night after AEW's Double or Nothing. As y'all know, a lot of superstars has debuted on there. Um, including, um, I have to get the names for you, <clears throat> but the biggest one is John Moxley. And if you don't know, is he signed a multi-million dollar deal and thing. And I want to give you a couple of superstars that I feel this man, if he don't want what happened with Dean Ambrose have to happen again, then he needs to be offering these superstars multi-million multi -million deals and stuff. So y'all know Charlotte Flair probably has a multi-million deal, million deal, including Roman Reigns, Seth Rollins, and thing. So I want to, so without further ado, let's get started. <clears throat> and excuse the voice, y'all. It's rug is going in and out. So excuse me about that. So the first thing I want to talk about, I want to talk about Apollo Cruz. Apollo Cruz, when he I remember when he first came to the WWE, I said, okay, that's an up-and-coming star. But I see star quality, but it's time for I mean, he's still under contract, but I feel like he needs to be offered a multi-million dollar deal or a million dollar deal in general, better for some years in financial, the finance, and you know, to give him a little more. And I can see him as a future WWE champion and Universal Champion. I think it it will be phenomenal to see. But um, as y'all know, I have a, if you don't know, I have a poll going on. And I'll get on that at the end of this video. So stay tuned. So, um, and the reason I feel like he needs that multi-million deal, he's that, he's that guy, I, the African-American guy, I can see being pushed and pulled. And they give him that chance. If that chance is arrived, I think he deserves a multi-million deal and stuff. So that's that. Number two, I, and I'm going to say um, Kofi Kingston. Um, I say Kofi Kingston deserves a multi-million deal as well because it's one of the, he's an up-and-coming superstar at the moment. As y'all know, he is the current WWE champion, and at so um, he's gonna be going up against um. Dolph Ziggler soon, but I'm going to say Kofi Kingston is a great superstar. It is his time to be in that position to do that. And I like I'm saying he he's well deserving of a multi million dollar deal as well. So I I, I mean that's my opinion on that. Now I'm going to get onto some females that I have noticed the last couple of years does deserve multi million deals. I will be talking about Sasha Banks in this too. So, without further ado, let's get started. So, the first one I need to talk about is Naomi. Why do Naomi do not have a multi-million deal or Becky Lynch? Let's talk about these two at the same time. All right. Let's start with Naomi. Naomi is very athletic. She's very, very there and then y'all have her as in the middle as just a jobber she, her job is not to be a jobber her job is to be a star she's multi-talented she does tricks she does a lot of different tricks in the ring and she's a much more she's very compatible very comparable to Lita so I don't get why she don't have a multi-million deal contract okay also who is comparable to Lita as well is Amber Moon. Now, Amber Moon, I can see it. She also deserves a multi-million deal. Do she? Yes, she deserves it. But we ain't gonna, we don't know if that's gonna ever happen. These are two beautiful African-American females that deserves those multi-million deals. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm not going through it, through it the dope. Now, my um second um my third um, person I really need to talk about. Okay. You got R-Truth. He's like a pro. 
He's not 50 just yet, but he's approaching up there. And that guy deserves a lot more than what they give him Give him credit for. It. And I promise you, he's been dash and dodging the people who wants to pin him for the 24-7 champion. He's been good at it. He's been good at it. With the help of Carmella. With him... With him, he also deserves a multi-million deal. Yeah, I like his comedic stint, but when it comes time for him to get serious, he can get serious. So, that's another person. Carmella, that's another female I will see, I can say, I can say deserve a multi-million deal. And, I mean, she's a wonderful female wrestler, and I just say, there go another female. Okay, last but not least, Sasha Banks. As y'all know, Sasha Banks, has refused, has, you know, have not been seen on WWE since WrestleMania. Okay, and I don't blame her. Now, if Vince want, okay, I'm going to be talking, I'm gonna, I got to do another video on, on this, on Sasha's situation, but I'm going to tell y'all, I'm putting, I'm, there's a lot of things that are going down. So, she's been doing, I know for a fact she has, she does still do a little stuff here and there. Anything, but that's that. She's still doing a little, a little stuff. But Sasha is was your big commodity. I think everybody will remember the big feud between Sasha Banks and uh, Charlotte Flair. That was um just what made that women's division. So I'm going. You are giving, you giving Charlotte Flair this multi million deal, and I I bet y'all on anything. Charlotte Flair has a multi million deal. Because of her father. Guarantee it. To get me to say. Who all don't think Sasha Banks. Deserve bigger. More money. More appearance. Okay. How many of our superstars. Have appeared on Wild and Out. That's not. Okay. I know we just had Trin. And the Usos just appeared on there. But if it wasn't for none other Sasha. Oh. We wouldn't know. But Sasha also has appeared on there. Sasha has done a lot more than what they give her credit for. And I promise you, Sasha Banks probably could make that women's division pop. So, y'all, let me hear what you think out of everybody that I mentioned. How many of those superstars deserve a multi-million deal for the, from the company. Until then, I'm Alicia. Don't forget to thumbs up this video, comment below, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.